Hi guys, I'm Liv, welcome to my channel. Today I am doing a video on Prior. Now this is a jewellery store, it's an online jewellery store and I picked up a few pieces and I wanted to give it a little review because this store does not get enough acknowledgement from people. Not many people talk about it. I think the stuff's really affordable, really decent and you'll hear my views and you'll see the jewellery and I'm going to give it a little review on quality, um, what you get for your money and also packaging and things like that. So first of all, everything comes in one of these little black bags. Now these are just little postal bags. They're also padded, so they have bubble wrap on the inside just to make sure everything stays safe and very delicate items and they're not gonna break with this package. Inside the little bag that you get, you get two little cards. So you get a pink one and a black one and they just look so professional, so cute. So I'm I'm a sucker for packaging. This one, it's about product care and explains how to keep your products basically clean, tidy and get the most use out of them and the most wear. It explains that you shouldn't towel with them or bath with them or swim with them and keep them away from perfume, liquids and lotions, which makes sense in my mind. I think if you just make sure to take it off before you go in the shower or in the bath or whatever, it would just keep the jewelry lasting a lot longer and it wouldn't tarnish as much anyway. One is a thank you note and it just says like, thank you for like ordering and that they hope that you like your jewelry. I'm gonna start off with bracelets. So I did get a bangle and this is the Roman numerals collection. And this is what it looks like. It's so pretty and I, I really like it. It's just really dainty. This was 16 pound, it wasn't that bad because I do shop from Indigo Loon and Pinch and Fold and their prices are quite expensive. Indigo Loon has recently gone under like refurbishment and they are very expensive nowadays, which is really upsetting because their jewelry is too very affordable, but that's a little side rant. But this is really cheap and really affordable in comparison to other jewelry places. Gold one that I got, I didn't, I don't like silver jewelry in my opinion. I have a couple pieces, but not much. And this is what it looks like, really pretty. 16 pounds as I said, there's an opening on it. So it's just the top and you just lift one side and it opens like so. And yeah, I'm just gonna put it on to show what it looks like on. It's really pretty like genuinely so pretty and I really want to get more bangles from them I have two um but I want to get so much more I've just got it on so that's what it looks like it's just a little bangle it's really really pretty and you can just go about your day with this like it doesn't really interfere with anything it's not something that you gotta keep like making sure it's on your wrist because it just it just sits there I can slide mine off if I like you know if I really try but it's not falling off anytime soon it does say on the website that this is water resistant however I just simply don't want to risk it in case that it starts to tarnish or anything any problem so far I've been wearing it for about basically ne nearly a week and I haven't had any issues with it. And I actually forgot to take it off once when I went to college. I take a very much active class and it was like sweaty and stuff. And I, I didn't know it's any tarnishing and yeah, it's completely fine. It hasn't left any green marks on my wrist or anything. It's really nice, really good quality and it's quite thick as well. So like you can feel the quality. It's light, but it's quite thick so that you can feel the quality. So yeah. The next bangle I got is a little bit heavier and came in a more luxurious bag. I have no idea why, but it came in this little white bag. This little like white, like off white cream bag. It came in that. I don't know why. Like, I really don't know why. I'm pretty sure it's like a similar price. So this was £18. So it was just two quid more, but it came in a little soft bag, which is nice, I guess. <laughs> I'm probably gonna keep that for like going abroad and stuff. And I'll probably keep this little, the little bags that you get for, I got for this one, maybe to keep like rings in when I go away. They're practical things. Like it's a little Ziploc bag. I don't know if I mentioned this, but the fact that the bangle came in by the way, the Ziploc bag, very good plastic, very durable, very nice. Back onto this bangle. So as I said, this is 18 pounds. It's a more full bangle. And um, there are no like little cutouts like on this one. It's just a full bangle. It's a little bit heavier as well, I noticed. <laughs> it's just a little like side note. Um, It's a little, it's also got Roman numerals on it again, as you can see. And it's just like a, it's all gold basically. So it's a slightly different opening. Again, it's like this one where you lift one side up. However, it's a flat opening as you can see there so open and i usually wear this on the opposite wrist i will say that i definitely want to get more bangles from here they're just they're so inexpensive and affordable and they last so well because i've been wearing them basically every day 
working out in them that was an accident by the way um but they haven't tarnished there's been no green nothing green appearing on me or anything so yeah they're really good and that's how it looks it's just there and it really match it just matches the other one and yeah it's like a yellow gold a yellow gold gold so yellow gold can look cheap but i feel like these just look really decent and they're just they're really pretty next thing i got was a little ring so if you know me i love rings so much and this i got for my first finger my pointer finger now this is in a size six i will say um a size six is a 52 um if that helps anybody so this matches one of my bangles so it matches this one with the cutouts so as you can see it's just another roman numeral style just a roman numerals ring and that just sits on my finger there and it just really matches everything else and i'm so glad it does because it's again a yellow gold piece and yellow gold can look as i said very cheap very tacky but these ones the yellow gold stuff looks brilliant honestly and with this i haven't noticed any tarnishing at all it's stayed the same color the whole time even the inside there's been no color fading or anything that's really good and nothing has faded the gold stayed exactly the same and i make sure not to put this in the water or anything and complaints it's really good now this was 16 pounds so you might think oh it's a bit much for a ring but in my opinion it's not because indigo Lean's prices are way up there and pandora's prices are up there but you're just paying for the quality and stuff so i genuinely think it's a great quality and yeah it just sits there all the time and it's really pretty and i love it doesn't leave my finger now this came in a tiny ziploc bag <laughs> now, this is a really small but i really like it so it's just a little ziploc bag with a little branding on the front it's quite a thick plastic and um yeah it, it's pretty packaging but probably gonna keep all of the packaging from this because i feel like i could reuse it in different ways the last thing i got was a necklace now this oh my god is probably one of my favorite pieces like i love everything i bought but this is just one of my favorite necklaces of all time honestly and it's a little date necklace this is a little personalized necklace so this was already going to be a little bit more money but this was 18 pounds on sale from 32 so i would go and head over and get this 100 percent. so this is the birth year necklace now there are tons of different birth years available so i will tell you the like from this year to this year so that is from 1990 to 2005 are the years available and yeah you can get it in either gold or silver and the that's with everything you can get everything in gold or silver this is how it looks i got 2003 which is my birth year it's so pretty i really love it again i got it in the yellow gold because my favorite 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 color of jewelry and this is how it looks it's so thick like i did not expect it to be that thick like it's so durable and that's not gonna like snap anytime soon or anything and it's really dainty so i can wear this on like a going out or just in the day and i do like to layer it up with these necklaces i did actually <laughs> i love watching jordan lipscomb and she always used to wear one of these little year necklaces now indigo loon used to do them like honestly ages ago but since their prices have gone up things for this like prices for this are like 50 quid on there so i didn't fancy paying the price of that it's just no no thank you but this one is 18 pounds so i do recommend it it's really nice really pretty this didn't come in a bag or anything this came in a little paper so that's what that came on and it's really pretty i've worn it maybe two three days i've not seen it tarnish it's not broken it's completely fine and it really matches up with my other jewelry which i love overall thoughts i love prior i honestly is it prior yeah i love prior <laughs> honestly think that they are a really great brand of jewelry the only thing i'm worried about is if they get a lot of popularity if they'll do the same as indigo loon has done because if they do that'd be a really big shame and i understand that indigo loon are trying to up their quality however the quality of prior is the same as indigo loon now and their prices aren't as high so i don't really know my opinions should probably just stay here but i i i different differently what i definitely think i oh my hair's fallen out of the clip <laughs> i definitely think i'll be shopping from prior a lot more than i ever thought i would because it's just a great brand and the jewelry is not expensive at all it's just a decent quality jewelry which has decent prices now in the information they do tell you what the quality is so i'm going to go through quickly and just tell you what all the um materials are um and yeah necklace the material is 18 karat gold on 
um, stainless seal stainless seals no stainless steel so it's a stainless steel underneath and it's plated with 18 karat gold which is good probably going to last quite a while it also says on here it's tarnish free which it is it gives the length of the chains the length of this little pendant and it also says that it's water resistant so i personally still wouldn't wear it in the water because i just wouldn't want to chance it but it's there if you want to like test it out if you think i do want to wear it in the water it says that it is water free like water safe on to the little ring that i have so it says here this is stainless steel and it's tarnish free and water resistant again so you can choose from with this one though rose silver what am i on about rose gold seal seal silver apparently my accent's all over the place today you can pick from rose gold silver or gold so i did pick gold onto the bangles so this roman numeral cutout bracelet is gold on stainless steel it's again water resistant and tarnish free and it just explains like the conference and like how big it is basically so you can measure it up on your wrist this bracelet this little bangle is also gold stainless steel and this is again tarnish free and water resistant and it explains all the dimensions and stuff on there. That's been my video on Prior. Um, I did want to do this video because when looking for reviews, I saw maybe two videos on it and I just think it's very important to put out videos basically saying this jewellery brand is legit just to let you know because sometimes it can be very easy to assume that something's a scam or fake or like not a real website or not good quality if we don't hear people raving about it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you like my vibe and you like the video, go subscribe down below. I will see you guys in the next video. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. It just helps me out if you actually enjoyed the video. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.